What's up guys, how's it going? Today we're gonna be traumatizing Sam. We've got our grass and we're gonna see some ass. We're back to doing what we do best, hurting me. You've read the title, you've seen the thumbnail. We're gonna be checking out some of the thirstiest art from my fans. I genuinely do not know why I do this to myself, but let's go. <laughs> Hashtag traumatize Sam. Oh. oh my, this is not a good idea. What are you doing, Miguel? Do I? I might have to censor that. You guys didn't have to go so hard. All Miguel pieces will be available as A5 prints. What are you guys doing with these prints? You put this up on your wall? What happens if your mom walks in? Jesus Christ. This is my thirstiest drawing I've ever done. Somehow I doubt that. Yeah, I know this. I feel like this is worse. Oh my. Our content aside though, the anatomy is actually really good in this piece. I can tell you've used your references. You've done your studies. So good job on that. And I've just spotted... Oh, Lord have mercy on me. Why would you seek help? Oh my God. Yo, hold on, <laughs> pause, wait. As said once before, I can explain. You can't explain this. This man just lives rent-free in my head for nine years. Oh, whose foot is that? Is that your foot? Whoa, hold up. why is he wet? What is that? <laughs> no, <laughs> stop. This piece is by Art Toes. I'm very happy with this painting. I feel like I cracked the skin toning like I rarely can. Yeah, no, you didn't crack skin toning. You cracked sunburning. I will say, though, that's some great rendering on the bounce light. I'm, I have to give it to you. Ugh. Oh, 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 this is highly disturbing. Let me give you a tip real quick. When you look up, the neck, see, it does not connect straight to the chin. It doesn't go like that, okay? When your neck connects straight to your chin, that's what you call a mouth breathing. So that's gotta be fixed. And then this piece might make me feel something. And what's with all the white liquid? Um, <clears throat> Jesus Christ. You know, the thing about these thirsty drawings is there's really good rendering here. Like you guys have nailed down your lighting and your shadows. Uh, I, I'm not even gonna lie, I'm, it's very impressive. And there's the sketch. That's great, bro. What did you do? This is blasphemy. What is going on here? Is this supposed to be the burb's body or did you put the guy's head inside the burb? I mean, either way, this is very concerning. You know what you need? Psychiatric assistance. Jesus Christ. I'm not completely satisfied. Why are you not satisfied? I love how this video is just turning into a great demo on how to draw spheres. Look at the rendering. You guys, this is nuts. Maybe this is the way. Instead of just learning how to render spheres, you can just draw some boobas. What the f? I have so many questions. Oh, oh, wow. These studies are really good. Oh my God. <laughs> what is, what is, oh my, stop. S stop, stop, stop it, stop it. Not bad. Okay, my most safe for work thirst trap. Otherwise it'll just be peepees. <laughs> Do you actually have peepees on your profile or? Nope, no peepees on your profile. That's false advertising, zero out of 10. But the anatomy on this piece is great. This guy looks like a Renaissance sculpture. You guys think that's what they were doing back then? Like those big, magnificent marble structures with tiny peepees. They were just thirst traps. What is that thing? Is it built like an elephant? All right, so here's a case of thirst trapping that has failed because the anatomy is a little bit off. And the caption says, I regret nothing. There's one thing you should regret and that is not learning anatomy. Get on it, learn your anatomy and then show me your thirst traps. Don't do this, don't. You're giving me 50% of your power right now. Push yourself. This is for you, Sam. I... <laughs> All right, Yusuf, tell me how this is thirsty art. Where's the thirst? It's a rat. Do you have a thing for rats? That's crazy. You guys are just outdoing yourselves with this phenomenal rendering. I love the core shadow, the highlights, and then the bounce light on the bottom side. Look at how the shadow carries into the clothing. It's fantastic. It's so round. It really is very impressive how... <laughs> no! <laughs> Look, before you go so ham on all your rendering, you gotta get your anatomy down the face. Her face looks like a Renaissance baby. Stop it. Stop it. No more Renaissance babies. No. What is this? Spa day with Shrek and Donkey? Oh, look at that. Just my type of guy. Giant dude with a PC. That's nice. Is that Henry? Henry Cavill? Oh, it is Henry. I love Henry. Traumatized Sam. Yeah, you didn't have to like... First time I learned to use a reference photo. What? This is your first study? What the heck? Great job. Imagine if I was playing 4D chess this whole time and I made this hashtag just so you guys can study your anatomy. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I don't I don't think that far ahead. I'm not that smart. I'm kind of dumb. Wow, again, fantastic rendering here. Fantastic. What's going on here? 
He's so muscular that he's starting to grow tumors. I mean, that's wild. I, you clearly have a good grasp on your rendering, but again, okay, study your anatomy a little bit more. Get your muscle structures down. What in, what the heck? What? Dude, I asked for, I asked for thirst traps. This is not thirsty yard. This is overhydrated videography. Oh my God, is that Miguel? What the hell is happening to my suit? <laughs> I just kind of like that. There's a bit of a story here. You give him a reason to be naked, you know? Uh, at this point, I'll take what I can get. Uh, this is very cute. I don't think this is thirsty at all. This is great. Oh wow, look at this time lapse. Okay, that's pretty... Um... Yeah, I spent a very long time on your line art. That must have been like 30 minutes. Do you guys do that too? Let me know in the comments below. How long do you guys spend on your line art? I would like to know. Listen, bro, I said thirsty art. Thirsty art. What part of this is thirsty? Are you attracted to this cat? Wow. You know what? This is pretty good. I love The Witcher. I've played through the game so many times and um, this is exactly what he does. This is him like 80% of the game. That's why the ratings for this game is so high. Yeah, believe it or not, the muscles here are actually not bad. They're decent. You could probably use a little bit more practice, but to be honest with you, we all can. But the problem is when you go up here, it's Lord Farquaad. It's no. Oh my God, it's Aaron. Aaron Yeager. Aaron Yeager. Oh, that is so creepy. That is very creepy. But the anatomy here looks great. I mean, that's... <laughs> what is that? No. Merlin, my poor boy. I enjoyed making this so I could show off his scars. Yeah, right. Yeah, I'm sure that's what you were trying to do. Oh my, why is he standing like an emoji? I apologize in advance for this abomination. The hands, the pose, the... Yeah, the hands, I don't think the hands are the biggest problem here. The biggest problem is the soft rendering. Look. Look, if you want to draw a good anatomy, you got to have hard and soft edges, okay? You can't just have all your blending be mushy and soft. Don't blend everything, okay? Now it looks like it's out of focus. Let's leave some hard edges here. Leave some sharp highlights. Make your subjects look wet. Make them look ju- I think I finally lost it, gone over the edge. You and me both, bro. You and me both. Look at this. <laughs> Who is this? It's like a blend of uh, Handsome Squidward and Megamind. It's glorious. Are you selling this by any chance? I'd like to make a purchase. After a six year break, you came back from a six year break just to traumatize me? I mean, I'm honored, but like, Look, I will say the perspective is quite impressive, but this hand, it needs help. It needs assistance. You're kidding me. Nylon study featuring one of my OCs. Why would you do your OC like that? Why would you violate them? I, it's good. I mean, the shading is very good. Yeah, it's <laughs> Jesus Christ. Now that's a good thirst trap. Classy, beautiful. And my God, look at the rendering in that water. That's fantastic. That That's a good thirst trap. I am, uh, I am, <laughs> I'm interested. <laughs> Not bad. Look at that. Renaissance thirst trap. The delts on this girl. Are you kidding me? This is an ab study? Dude, all I can see are the delts. These delts are fantastic. Another commission. Yeah, like, who's commissioning these? My god, she, look at her hips. She's thick. Thick. All right, so I get what you're going for here, but something is throwing me off with this tricep. It's like a tumor. Now listen, listen, take your arm. I want you to take your arm right now. Go in the mirror. Look, do you see the shape of this tricep? All right, it's not a bulge. It comes down. You see that? Oh, oh, absolutely glorious. You guys are out here thirst trapping with gorillas. That's crazy. That's crazy. Oh, Jesus Christ. Angel of death. Oh, it's a draw this in your style challenge. Okay, that's kind of cool. Look, if this is the angel of death, if this is what I'm going to see when I pass, I think now I'm ready to go. Who's with me? Come on, let's go. Okay, so with this piece, I think I've had just about enough. This is my toe. He lurks in my room. I hope you like him. Uh, what demonic force compelled you to draw on this? You know, I just don't understand. I think that Look, so I think with this video, if there's one thing we've learned, it's that anatomy is very important. So if you want to do thirsty art like the ones that you've seen in this video, you got to know your anatomy. All right, let this video be a sign for you to learn anatomy because I'm tired. I'm tired of seeing tumors on muscular men. It's not. Come on. It's not that hard. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more blasphemous content just like this. And if you want to help support my future therapy sessions, check out my Patreon. With that being said, I'll see you guys on the next video with a little bit less of my sanity intact. <laughs>